Hello guys and welcome to a tutorial on how to get Optifine for Hexit. So, the first step is to go to your Technic folder. And for most people, if you left it as default, it will be in the library and application support. So you just go to the folder and then you can find your Technic folder. And once you open your Technic folder, you go to your Hexit folder. After that, you click on your bin and then you can see there are a couple, um, couple, um, dot jars. So that's not important. So this is originally a dot jar. Okay, I changed it to a dot jar. And use dot jar. It's not important. So this is how you should originally see it as. And next, you go to you change it into a dot zip, and then you keep it dot zip. And my icons messed. Oh. Actually, yeah, it's it's working, and now you double click, and the name is specific. It can only be modpack dot zip. It cannot be anything else. So you go and go get modpack, and then you double click on it. So you see all these classes, and now you open your Optifine, and you grab your Optifine, and then you open it up, and you co copy every single class in it and post it into the uh, modpack. So you replace it, and then it should be good. So now the next step is the most important step because it's the one that most people overlook. Most most people will just open the Techie Launcher and just log in. And if I can show you, if you log in like that, I'll just show you what happens. So it's just log launching and waiting for it to launch. I'm not sure why it's not launching. Um. Okay, yeah, it's launching now. So as you can see, everything perfectly fine. However, once it loads, you can see that it is no longer hex it. It's just 1.5.2 and everything is default. So in order to fix this, you have to be able to e turn it into a mod still. So you take control Command A and you highlight every single class <clears throat> and then you right click on it. And then you should compress 318 items. If you only have Optifine, it should be exactly 318 items. So now you compress it. And then as you can see, it will be saved under a folder, a dot zip called archive. And we should be closing in on it. Uh, let's see. Archive. Eh. Let's see. Yeah. Uh, ooh, apparently I, I hmm, I'm try that again and compress and where it should be archive 2 I'm the archive 1 so oh there it is so now you go and you get this and you change the name to modpack dot jar and then oops uh mod pack dot jar and keep dot jar so after that you I think it's good now you just launch it you just launch um your hexit and launch and I think it will I'm pretty yeah so after this, it's just going to set everything up again, and after that, once it logs in, um, let's see, wait for it to log in, wait for it to log in, wait for it to log in, that's the problem with these mod packs, they take a really long time to log in, and let's see. Are you logging in yet? Okay, and you can see the mods are back. And if or not here, and you can see Optifine is installed. And if you go to the options, you can go see the video settings and you can see that there are the and uh, the options of Optifine. So that's how you install Optifine for Hexit. So thanks for watching. Make sure to rate, comment, subscribe, and see you next time.